Good afternoon, Colorado. Welcome to a Friday edition of Local Biz Buzz. I'm your host, Larry Hers, and today in studio, I'm Allie with Chin Dribbling. Welcome. Hi. <laughs> so many connections between us. We have friends in common, Sorry. clients in common, and your sauce was here, what was that, December maybe? Yes, yeah, Shop with, Bodega with Josh, yeah. Your sauce was here without you, and that's how we probably got connected. Yes. And now you're here. Give them a little history of you and your company. Ah, uh, so I have been cooking. I lied about my age when I was 14 and stuck in my first pizza shop. Uh, and I've been cooking ever since. Um, let's see, I started running my first restaurant at 21. Worked in a gourmet catering company for years. Uh, I ran Chop Shop for three or four years. I can't tell. Shout out the boys. Uh, yeah, Clinton Christian, love ya. Well, uh, <laughs> Yeah, they're the best. Uh, love that job. Missed that pastrami sandwich so much. Uh, <laughs> and then, yeah, I didn't know. They were like, what are you going to do? And I was like, well, I don't want to run a restaurant anymore or own a restaurant. So I started a sauce company, and now it's a 24-7 job. What was the first <laughs> sauce you came up with? Uh, first sauce, I technically was the Kung Lao, but the one I came uh, showed the world to was the steak sauce first. Right. Um Steak sauce is, you can use it as a steak sauce or Worcestershire sauce, so I'm in a Bloody Mary with it today. Okay, before we get into the food and products, we have some special announcement that we want to knock off because, you know, you guys aren't going to watch the whole 10 minutes, at least, you know, most of you. So tell them. Yeah, so uh, I'm doing a giveaway today, so uh, I have two full sets for people to win. It's on Instagram. You have to like and follow both of us, uh, comment. Uh, what you would use the sauce on or who you would share it with. Um, and then I also have a coupon code OCN Eats 15 for the website. You can get 15% off anything on the website. Brilliant. Yeah. That's how you do a show. Yeah. First of all, perfect amount, showcasing everything. All right, let's start with uh, the mustard and the pretzel. Yeah. And also, yeah, we gotta need to talk about Flight Co. I guess. Yeah, it's their four-year anniversary this weekend, so I figured I'd shout them out. All right, so tell me about this. What's in it? How did it happen? What's it good with besides pretzel? So that mustard's actually super unique. It's a curried beer mustard. Um, so it's sweet, savory. Uh, you get a little horseradish at the end of it with the brown mustard, um, and salty. So it's like very well balanced, real tangy. Uh, it's great with pretzels. They serve it with pretzels and their bagel sandwiches at Flight Co. Um, I make dressings with it. I rub it on pork tenderloin. It's super unique and people go wild for it. They buy like jars and jars at a time. Um, that's that one. Yeah, it's, it's delicious. All of you can try after, obviously. Um, my favorite is this sweet thing right here, Kung Lao. Uh, people literally drink it out of the bottle. Yeah, it's right there. Um, it's the best dumpling sauce. It's gluten-free and low sodium. Uh, has citrus, chili, all the things in it. Um, yeah, it's great with that. It's great with sushi. Uh, you can use it as a stir-fry sauce. All the things. Do you want it? You can have it. Do you want one too? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta reward the camera people. Otherwise, they won't film anymore. Yeah. You can just drink it right out of the cup too. <laughs> no judgment here. I do it all the time. At markets, we do soft shots with people. Yeah. Dude, do you smell that? Yeah. <laughs> like a mess all over the Keep talking. Um, yeah. Uh, my newest one that just came out is the spicy pineapple peanut sauce. It's also gluten free. Um, here's that if you need it. It's super good, spicy, not too spicy, obviously, because the peanut mellows it out. Um, but yeah, I'm, you can use it with spring rolls, obviously. I do peanut noodle bowls with it all the Which time chicken wings, so many things. There's a ton of recipes on my website as well if you have no idea how to cook anything with those. Um, and then also they come with these little cook with us things. And then they show you like things you can cook with on the back if you're not a chef like me. Um, so yeah, that's, oh yeah, go ahead, try that. <laughs> Two more minutes. We'll We're be excited. there. We'll be there. <laughs> um, yeah, and then the steak sauce. Like I said, it, you can use it as a steak sauce, a marinade, or a Worcestershire sauce. So, threw it in a Bloody Mary for you today. I don't know who gets the joy of drinking that today, but there's definitely vodka in that. Nice. 
Um, but yeah, that's also an incredible marinade. It has tamarind in it, which has natural meat tenderizing enzymes in it. So you only need to marinate a steak if you do like marinating steaks. I'm a salt and pepper type of girl. But uh, for like one to two hours, and that's really it. And then the brown sugar like caramelizes the meat too. It's really good. Dude. Yeah. I'm not a bartender, but I love my Bloody Marys. Fantastic. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> mm. What'd you use on the rim? Tahine and agave, because it sticks better. Food photography. Mm. But yeah. Um, yeah, and then I hope people win these, because they're uh, like $50 of product for two lucky winners, so. Okay, million dollar question. Where the heck can people buy this? Ooh, so many places. Uh, you can buy them online, obviously. We ship nationally as well. Um, I'm at Shop Bodega, which is an online marketplace. Uh, I'm at the Coop in Arvada, Littleton Meats, and then most recently Farm Girl Foods in Castle Rock. So. And then if they wanted to buy them online, uh, they go to, what's the website? Chindribblin.com. Um, and then I'll be at tons of markets this season. If you go on the website, there's a Find Us page. Um, so it lists all the stores that I'm in and then every market that I'll be in this season. So you can follow me around, come to Evergreen, Arvada, Golden, all the places. What's the future for you? <sighs> Growth. We're just growing, yeah. I, I got new sauces coming out this year. We're uh, doing a bit of revamp with our packaging soon. And then market season starts, so we're just going to be non-stop. I also produce, bottle, label all of my own products. This is, you created that? I do all of it, yeah. I also mm -hmm. do all the nuts. graphic designing on my website. Uh, my friend Meg d takes photos of me. Um, but yeah, it's... And what are your uh, socials? They should probably follow you. Yeah, they, yeah. So uh, my Instagram is Chindriblin LLC. That's, that's it. Um, when we do the giveaway, you'll probably be able to see that as well. Mm -hmm. I don't have a TikTok, probably should get one. Um, and then Facebook's just Chin Dribblin. And like I said, the website is chindriblin.com. All right. Yeah. You said I should eat this. You so should. I'm going to eat this. Or just drink it straight out of the bowl. Too bad Hillary wasn't here, but we won't bring that up. Yeah, we won't bring that up, Hillary. Thanks for not coming. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. <laughs> we forget anything? Uh, I don't think so. Yeah. All right. I, uh, I'm excited for whoever wins these. They're great products. Everybody have a great weekend. Uh, check me out tonight on CBS. In theory, I'm on at 420, but they change the times every week. Mm -hmm. And we'll be featuring Co-Arc Collective, a new Asian food hall on Parker and Arapahoe Road. So, you know what we say? Cheers. Mm. Oh, let's eat! Yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Don't mind if I do. That sauce is drinkable. <laughs>